time they hot fix their game essentially this is where they don't need to go through the patch system and where they can update it through either tunables or changing code and today they've actually removed a few rare items and cool features that I really don't know why they've been removed. It's kind of a mystery. They haven't given any explanation, and it's kind of been like weird trying to figure out what's been going on. So the first thing that was removed was the Pogo the Space Monkey Mask. This can no longer be purchased from the Vespucci movie mask shop. Now, this is one of the most popular masks in the game. If you don't know what it looks like, it's the monkey with the cigar sticking out of his mouth. It's also the Louis Calibre mask, if you want to call it that. So that has actually been removed. It required level 100 to purchase and I actually didn't have it you know I was gonna get it instead of my stocking mask but I found out it wasn't available and it, it, you know it just kind of came as a surprise to me it was like whoa the pogo monkey mask is missing so this is a rare mask that requires level 100 to get that can no longer be purchased in the game so hopefully Rockstar has an explanation for that soon because I know this is a very popular mask and it's something that I definitely wanted to have added to my inventory Another change that Rockstar's made is that Titan doors can no longer be open. So for whatever reason, there's something going on with the Titan. Maybe Rockstar found a glitch in it, and you can no longer open the back of the Titan door. Now, this could be used to store vehicles or do funny moments or put people in the back, but now you cannot open the hatch on the back of the Titan. So that's kind of unfortunate that we can no longer do stunts and tricks and whatnot uh, with that vehicle. Now, the user Osborne to Shred on the Grand Theft Auto Reddit says, Jet mechanics have changed. He says, you now lose more altitude in a knife or inverted flight than you used to, and you can't do the reverse flip anymore. So for you jet experts out there, they've kind of changed the mechanics a little bit. I'm not an expert flyer myself, so I don't really know all what that means. I know that when you fly in a knife or an inverted flight, that's when you're either flying sideways or upside down. But nevertheless, I do think that's kind of interesting that Rockstar has adjusted the mechanics on a jet. That's kind of like a weird miscellaneous thing to change. As far as missions go, they've kind of removed a few of them from being played in the inventory. Now, I'm not sure if this is on old gen or next gen, but Chopper Tail and a few other missions can't be played by accessing through the job menu. The only way you're going to be able to play those jobs now is if they're sent to you through various contacts on your phone. So I don't know if Rockstar is adjusting the RP or payouts for any of these missions or if there's something glitched inside of them. But for right now, a few of these fun missions have been removed. So we're going to have to wait for Rockstar to tell us what's up and to give us any future updates. And the last thing to note for now is the Sea Shark on old generation, that being 360 and PS3, cannot be purchased from any of the in-game weapons websites for whatever reason rockstars just removed this again i'm not sure if it's a glitch or if there's something wrong at the price point but for now on 360 and ps3 this vehicle cannot be purchased so i definitely want to hear from you guys in the comment section down below on if you noticed any other changes that rockstar might have made for now the weapons from the dlc are still available that being the homing missile and the proximity mine there's also the firework launcher that is available so those things haven't been removed yet i went this morning and checked just to make sure that they were still there but they are so that's still good news let me know what you find and let me know in the comment section down below be sure to leave a like on the video if you did enjoy and also subscribe to my youtube channel if you are new or you like daily gta 5 videos like this without the way guys like i said thanks for watching take care and i'll see you guys in the next video